stayed up with him and then he's kind of um he had to go to the bathroom and a few other things so i really haven't slept all night but i'm getting ready to go to the airport right now um it is currently 444 oh we're going to with me um i'm so emotional already leaving <laughs> i'm so excited to see my mom but i'm really sad to leave the gunner <laughs> so <sighs> excited to go to I spew and go hike tomorrow to Aspen, but it's just always hard leaving home. I love my husband and my son so much, so I'm just gonna enjoy the time with my mom and think about that. And I think right now it's probably the hardest just getting out of the house and not him waking up without me. <laughs> so yeah, anyways, I love him so much. I love my family. But time for us to get going here. A lot to do. Some eggs boiling some water boiling and have a little tea and get ready to go to the airport here so, bye home we love you we'll see you soon i have decided to take a town with a car um because parking was really crazy last time i went to lax and i wasn't able to find parking and i was missing a flight Plus, I always love some Empire CLS. That's who I always use since the beginning of the hills in gosh, 2006, 7, 8 for Spencer and I. So I'm in the car, have my eggs, gonna go ahead and eat that. Pounded a cup of tea really quickly. My flight leaves at 7:10, and I think we should be on good time. It's 5:15, 5:20. Feel like with or without kind of boys. To deal with Remo and he was pooping and oh my gosh, just the whole thing with that dog. But anyways, I'm at the house and then to the airport. So I'm here to the airport. Awesome town car. Gonna get on United so only one that flies in the place. Thank you, thank you so much. My pleasure. My pleasure. Have a great day. Make days. sure to forget to zip this. Perfect. Awesome. Thank you. Have a great day. Okay, so here, this might be my last alone trip before I have another one, so I've got my mask, I'm going to get Happy Wednesday. You know, it's an early morning when I thought it was 6.30. I'm like, oh my gosh, my flight's 40. No, it's only 5. So, I have a little bit of time to try to find some headphones. I don't have any headphones. Check into TSA pre-check. TSA pre-check is like the best thing ever. At least in LA. I'm not to take my shoes off. If you ever thought about getting TSA pre-check, I highly recommend it. Well worth whatever it takes to get TSA pre-check. Funny, after that actually my TSA pre-check number is even on it. So I'm gonna have to go back and get my TSA pre-check because I'm not going through the radio scanner or something like that. So I'm gonna go back and get that first. Pretty ironic. Now I have my PSA pre-check, TSA pre-check, pre and I'm gonna go through it. Well worth it. So, here we go. Let's try this again. I always try to bring my own water bottle. You can fill them up here. And you don't have to buy any water. Plus there's no plastic in it, so. Just bring my own water bottle. And it's even actually better water. But it's water. Airplane. So I have a really tight layover. I have about 15 minutes to get there and I just found out that I have to go from the 23s where we land all the way to 86 in 15 minutes. So I'm saying a prayer that I make it because that's really far in DIA. Yeah. 
gates to get here. So that did make it, thank God. I only had seven minutes to get here, thank God. But I did, I ran through all of there. Whew. On the way to Crested Butte. You're here, finally home. Yay! This is my uh, first alone trip just for me, you know, because I came for Sky's baby, oh, came to see yeah. Noah, came home for Uncle Crescent, uh -huh. came home to bring Gunner. But this is a trip just, just for you. Us, just How's for it going me. so far? So good. <laughs> really uh, riveting. Oh, it's an adventure. It's always it an adventure is. to fly into. Crested view, isn't it? That's right. And this is my mom. Hi. Everybody knows my mom. Okay. My mom brought some champagne for us to pop. A little champagne to get this party started. Woo! Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. We have a cheese board in the back, too. Oh, my gosh. What a luxurious weekend. We have to get ready for our hike to Aspen tomorrow. Best restaurant in town. That's right. <laughs> Great. Oh, so excited. Woo! Cheers. Cheers. Overflow in there. But that's enough for me. Oh. <laughs> Thank you. Oh. Woo! Oh. To your Aspen, Colorado hike. Yes, cheers. How many annual? How many times have you done this? Gosh, great questions. Um fix every my year hair since questions. you were seven. Yeah, but then that was I've the first missed time a you few went. years. And then we haven't done this in four years, mm -hmm. right? You and I. Because I got pregnant, and then I had Gunner, and then I haven't been able to leave him. So who knows if I'll have another kid or not. But if I do, mm -hmm. then God willing, I'd be pregnant or having a baby next year. Yeah. So I was like, this is That's it. That's why it was important for you to come this year. Right. So and you made it happen. Good. An adventure to get here. <sighs> Sprinting between flights. Oh, this tastes So good. your plane circled the airport. It was like landing, and then yeah. it pulled up. So we were landing. Literally touched down 15 minutes early. I was like, perfect. I can just walk to the gate. I'll get there right on time because I just had a 20 minute layover, which it said takes oh 20 minutes to gosh, walk. Which you were already nervous about because it's how many gates? Like, yeah, it was 60, 60 gates. 60 gates had I had to go to. So I, um, yeah, so then we're late. And then we're we're landing, and then they pull up. Like, oh, oh, it's the worst! I know. And you I was don't like, think that's oh. gonna happen. You're just like, oh, we're here, yay! And they were like, well, there was another plane on the runway. Oh my god! The, the pilot kept being so aggro. He's like, everybody's layover is gonna make it. Everyone needs to relax. No one was saying anything. <laughs> <laughs> Like that guy that was trying to pick a fight with you to get your bag loaded? He was oh, like... I, so, yeah, I would have even said that. And you were stories. just like, okay. Oh my gosh. It, so this... And I'm like, maybe not. I literally have five minutes to run 60 gates. So I had to like pull my mask lower so I could breathe. And I'm sprinting <laughs> through the airport. Legs are on fire. On fire. Wobbling. I'm like, okay, I just got to... I'm like, switching hands. Switch. Drag this in. By the way, and they were filming Excuse because me. I saw it. So I was just like... Just quick. Just quick. <laughs> On this. And then I say, excuse me. And I'm like trying to talk. I can't even breathe. People are like barely moving on the side. I was like, why don't I just run some people over? Like, you just got to go. If anyone saw me and they were like, that was Heidi would be so funny. I was sprinting pretty good pace, like running. Strong. All those the workouts airport. paying off. Yeah, totally. Stronger than you realize. Oh my gosh. So I ran through the whole thing. Then I get to the gate. Every, they're boarding, right? Half the plane's boarded. I only have like 10 people oh behind me, if gosh. even. But I so had much for priority. that pre-check or priority. I or... did have priority. That's why ah. I did cut in front of ah, people. Ah, okay. And then the guy at the gate was like, your bag will not fit on this plane. And I was like, it, I I was like, actually, on this exact plane, I, this bag has fit many times. He's like, no. <laughs> and then I just took the ticket. I'm like, I'm not arguing with this guy. Oh, wow. I'm just not going to put it there. Wow. And I said, well, and then the, I get on. And I think he, I don't know if he called the stewardess or if it was just a different thing or the flight attendant. And he said... Um, your bag is not going to fit on this plane. The next person, the yeah, flight attendant said person, that? he did. And I was like, well... We got a runner. I, <laughs> She's coming in hot. Oh Don't let God. her on. I was like, well, I, I I might as well just try. He's like, no, I'm trying to save you a trip. And I said, well, put my stuff down and then I'll deal with it after. Wow. So Such I put my attitude. stuff down. And then, of course, it fit. Of course. You've I was like, I've been on times. this plane more times than you probably. Yeah. So anyways, oh I didn't take no gosh. for an answer. And no, I, but you were polite the whole time. You stayed composed. 
after all that stress you'd been under and you still were able to stay composed and polite and Thank you. kind and yeah and i was like well i'm just done. get on this flight and advocating for yourself and being assertive but true that's what assertive is it's being respectful and sticking in for yourself yeah it's like you can't tell me well that what i can and can't do if i well done and here you are Woo! Woo! Here. with your bag with, with my bag <laughs> This is our warm-up hike, right, for tomorrow? Yes. We're in the deep magical forest. There's a beast. Ha! Ah! Oh, nice try. You. <laughs> oh my gosh, look ah. at this. Wow. Look how tall the trees are. They're like 50 feet high. Wow. Those pine trees across the river, how high those are. Wow. Um, I think it's going to rain, right? Uh, I'm not here. Yeah. We got to go find the rain. So beautiful. That's like a magical fairy tale forest. It's enchanted. Is it chanty? Woo! You hear that? It's the rain. I wanted it to rain. I've been praying for rain. Yay! <laughs> yeah, feel the rain on your skin. That's right. I'm like, which song are we singing? <laughs> so happy. Woo! It's right out! Woo! Woo! Yeah! Come on, God! Lightning and thunder! Let's go! Let's go! Woo! Here's Crested View Mountain. It's the park I grew up in. It's a gorgeous hometown here. We are hitting the town. Yeah. Gonna get some sunglasses. You made it after a big hike. You're strong. You're ready. You're ready. You think I can make the hike run. tomorrow? Absolutely. I'm gonna slay it. Okay. I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna go get some sunglasses, which I need because mine are a little bit loose. Mm, they're very stylish, though. So. Yeah. And they weren't that loose. They just got loose. Oh, Thank you, God. All things are being answered. Find the rainbow. Where's the rainbow? With the pot of gold. And then we have a great dinner. Oh yeah. Sunflower. Mm. Very, Very special. Look at this town. Who wouldn't want to grow up here? I sure loved it. Mm. Still a little rain. Mountain. Coming into Crested Butte Shades here. This store has been here for about 40 years. I'm trying to see if my shades will stay on on the hike and if I'm running. So I'm going to try them out, see if they stay on. I think they'll be good for the hike tomorrow. Hopefully they'll stay on. We'll see. But I like them. What do you think? Good for the, good for the trails? Probably. Now we're at the Princess having some shampoo. Cheers. Cheers. Sometimes they have live music here. Tyler Hansen. Raining. Listen, can you hear it on the roof? Can you hear We're it sitting under this wonderful umbrella of a pine tree that's totally dry. Triano, our fest park. Triano, our fest park. Amazing bread, mm -hmm. olives, so symmetry. Wine. I love two tops because I can make them <laughs> perfect <laughs> art. <laughs> this is our amazing ambiance, great energy. We appreciate it. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Here we go. So here is the. What is this one? This is the Malbec the Katina. But that's our first one. Oh, the Triana. Triana. Mm -hmm. 2018. This is the Malbec. Back to back. 